Welcome back to Let's Cash More Mash. My name's Tom. And I'm Mike. And today we're cracking open a new bottle of a Smoke Wagon Malted Straight Rye Whiskey. So this one, I got to give a shout out to a super fan of the channel, Steve. Thank you very much for finding this one because these do not come to Massachusetts. This was one that he found when he was on his, one of his couple trips that he made to uh, New York for us. Uh, well, not for us, but was indirectly for us while he was there. So uh, thank you again for finding this, Steve. And this was also suggested by Danny. So I, I, uh, I, was, I was super excited to try it anyway. So let's get through the particulars. So this one comes in. It's Smoke Wagon straight white malted rye whiskey comes in at 119.58 proof we got it for the low low price of 74 dollars and 99 cents so the company it's aged and bottled at the nevada hnc distillery company the distillery itself is mgp or ross and squibb the mash bill is 51 percent rye 49 percent malted barley our bottle was bottled on 10 14 2022 and it happens to be batch number 2a so all I got out of this was, it's different, and I can't wait to see Mike try it. So this one's for you, Danny. Yeah, thank, thank you. Thank you for everything you do for the channel. Yes, thank you. So I said, I got to get this one out. So I dug deep, because we've had this one now for a while. It's good, at least a half a year, the last time he went down, or a handful of months anyways, that Some Steve grabbed I thought us. I seen that somewhere not far. Did I take a picture and send it to you when you said, where, where are you? I thought it I don't know. I, it wasn't this one, but I, I get I so many wire. pictures from I know, people, I so I, 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 I do not remember. All I know is I, I, I've never seen them. I've seen one, I think, behind glass once at, in one single store, but I, these aren't. These don't come to Massachusetts that I know of. But if you do see them, leave a comment down below. We get a lot of people that say that I'm wrong sometimes when I say that. But then again, I've had others come back and go, nope, you were right. It wasn't there. So... I've never seen them in Mass, uh, and, and again, I go to Connecticut, I've been to Rhode Island, I don't see them there either, but yeah. he, the closest I've found, he's found them in New York, and he's got one store that he's gone to a couple times where he's found a lot of them in New York. In fact, we have one left, and ironically, it's a rye, but we, because uh, <laughs> we did all the other They've ones. They've been coming out a lot lately. Well, this one, this one, this one's different, though, because you don't see this, this, a mash bill like this where it's 51% rye. You do a mint nose. Well, it's. It, I didn't think we were gonna, but I'm wondering what the malt's gonna do. So I'm gonna have to get this. I'm trying to get a nose. I'm not getting a good. It's nose almost like yet, a sugary so. nose, though. I know we like the malted bourbon that we had, so I was wondering what it was gonna do with the rye, how much it changes it. You know, you're drinking it. I'm gonna have to take a sip. Mm. You, it, it hits you pretty quick right off the bat. So well, it is 119.5. I, 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 I just registered that. Oh, there is some huge pop rocks going on my tongue. Yeah, I took a small yeah, yeah. sip. Yeah, I did. The I'm, minute it I hit my tongue, though, I did get the the mint flavor as soon as it much. hit my tongue. You didn't? No. Right, let me let me try it again. I took a little Not sip. Compared to, I haven't drank yesterday? anything yet. Either. Yeah. Yeah. It, and the day before, those, oh, no, were, those were like, like no, whist, yesterday whist, was like ultra mint. Well, the whistle pig was yeah. when we did that one. Yeah. No, the, again, I'm not kidding. I'm sorry, whistle pig. I know you'll never sponsor us, but <laughs> I've yet to have any of them that aren't anything that other than just mint flavor. Uh, the bourbon was fair. No, I'm talking any of the rice. No, no, yeah, yeah the rice yeah, were yeah. like the, all three that we did were. It's definitely we, giving... we did we we were able to figure which one was which, but. I'm not sad with the nose. I don't know. No. If I, I don't. I wouldn't call this a rye with the nose. No, I don't know. Let me have a, Let me take a second. It's step. like a. It's like a sugary, syrupy nose. Mm. If there's mint, it's very, very light. If, oh, I, I can't believe you say that. It's an instant. As soon as it hits my tongue. It's funny how we sit here. It's it's it, 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 it's, it's sparkly. It, I mean, we, it, we, and we drink it on. together, and that, it just goes to show. Like it doesn't matter what everybody says. Like doesn't I can matter. give you full flavor <laughs> profiles, all the different things. You work your own person, and everyone tastes something totally different. Mine, as soon as it hits my tongue, I get a mint. And uh, if anyone's had it, leave it down Strong? below. So, it, a really, decent mint. Mm -hmm. it, there's a decent mint in there. Like it is a definitely as soon as it hits, and then when you when you roll around. I'm trying to get what that middle flavor is. Roll around, is. it gets it gets hot like a cinnamon. 
I will agree. Good. It's I a don't, sparkle, I don't you know. get the mint off the nose. No. I'm getting more of a, I don't know. I don't know what to call this. I, I want to call it like this. Like sugary, a, sugary You syrup. don't get like a, a, a slight, it's not a funk though, but it's it's not in a bad way. Like a slight. I could see like a white sugar, just a plain sugar sugar you're talking? Sugar water, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, 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 yeah. That, like a rock candy type yeah. sugar. Okay, yeah. I, I can see that not so much. That. Not so much the, the I don't know. I, I'm, I'm really not disappointed with this for a being a rye. I, I kind of like the extra proof. I kind of like the... The way Danny described it was that it was really different. So I was actually thinking it was going to bring me in like the single malt land when we... Like like a... Cra this is actually I to was, me... I was thinking it was bring, going to bring me beyond like whistle pig times two. No, That's I where I was, was going. Oh yeah. See, so, no, I went the other way. You know, Do you remember when we did the New Riff single malt and it was just a wild ride of crazy flavors? It kind of brought us to Texas with all like the... Yeah, the, the, the little so bread, with little the, that. Little, yeah, yeah. So with this heavy bread malt, here, I'm not no, I'm I, I'm waiting on that. I'm I'm trying to let it sit in the glass a little bit. I'm actually di I actually like this. I I, I just yeah, said I, I, I do. For I was actually I thought Danny was going to play games and, and <laughs> screw with me. So I I was like, all right, let's expect the worst. But it's actually I'm not I'm not upset. I'm actually shocked you're not getting the mint in the front, which which because really. normally you don't like the mint. This oh, doesn't this is, this is I, even a quarter of what we had the last couple of days. I will say though, it doesn't bring you. It's not bringing me to bourbon land at all, though. At all. No, it, like, I'm it, not getting any of the caramels or the things. I'm not even getting, like, a an oaky finish at the end. No, you're um, getting more of the pop rock, which is good. Yeah. Like, that's, that's the only part that probably lead me to a rye. Yeah, oh, yeah, you definitely. It's pop rock like crazy on your tongue. That, for sure. and there is proof. So, it, that's, that's going to be, a, this will be a tough one. But it's not drinking uber hot, though, because this is the first still drink. sparkles. No, 100%. I, I'll give you that. Does it hang around forever? No, but I've been, mm. been taking baby, baby sips too, so. Mm -hmm. I just took a good one right there, and I rolled it all up. So when you leave it on your, when you leave it on your tongue like that. It hangs on. Well, you, you do get, I don't know if I'd be able to say it's a malt though, but you know when you get like a, like a thicker weeder or the, like you almost get that. Oh, it's got to be the, the malt. If it was, you a get like the malty would, flavor, though. You wouldn't get that sparkle. Well, no, I, yeah, because it, it. Well, it is a rye, but I, I'm talking about like when you get like it. There's a different texture. There's like a thickness that it actually. I, I actually like I'm this. I'm not. I, yeah, I was gonna say I'm not sad with it. No, honestly. Um, I was all the way down the bottom. Um, what I, is what is the average price for the smoke wagons? Is it usually seventy five? Is that usually where we're at? Or because it's up in proof? Is that why it's that high? And they, they only range. because I, I just don't. Uh, ouch. The, I, never, the, I never bought it, so I the don't know. single malt was was higher. I'll just look at these because this is what we have left. The single malt was seventy two, and the single barrel. You're in New Riff. I'm in New Riff. What am I looking at? You, <laughs> I was gonna say. You know why? Because I was totally thinking you could. No, this one was like thirty one dollars. Uh, the younger was like forty fifty five dollars, and the this one, this was the younger was forty two dollars fifty five dollars for the small batch. And the this one's seventy. The uncut and unfiltered was seventy one ninety nine. So they they vary in prices depending on what you go. Yeah, but I it, forgot what the. I have a rye is, over there. That's, proof that's up there. So I have the I have a regular rye over there too, from them that I think is around this somewhere in this general range, and it's New York pricing. So I don't know what they it, technically it normally the, are, but um, because that's what bottle we design is decent. I do like the nose. I'm trying to figure out what other smell I'm getting, because I don't get. The mint on the nose. There is definitely no mint. So now the longer it, I poured a little bit more because I wanted to see that. The longer this sits in the glass. It's getting closer to a bourbon than it is a rye. I'm, I'm going to say, I was just going to say, <laughs> on, on on the nose, the caramel is starting to come it, it, out. It, it now you're getting like that. To, back to that sweetness of. You know what you're almost getting to me? It's starting to just, it's, it's starting to teeter to like almost like a. Like an oatmeal with a maple syrup. Mm. I'm, I'm, it's not. It's as I knew you were going to say instead, oatmeal, and I don't get. I get more of a caramel. Well, instead of caramel, a caramel, you get syrupy. the sweetness from like a like a like if you took an oatmeal and you put like a little bit of maple syrup in it. That's what I'm kind of getting. It, it, right you'd now. almost go into the into the maple syrup hut where they're cooking it down, right? Right. And you have that that smell. Kind of would go. I would go somewhere there. Um. Again. I was I was expecting the worst, Danny. So mm -hmm. I I I'm not disappointed with this. 
I know you said it was different. You'll have to leave a comment down below if you actually liked it. I know he, he was excited Hello, to what, see you try is, it. But the different I, part would be it's not really categorized. It's going to be a tough one to call a rye. Because I'm not getting a mint. See, that's, for me, I think as soon as it hits my tongue, I'm getting mint. I don't really get the mint. I get a sparkle, which is that's... You know, I could I could almost confuse that. We finally proof. got one that's up upwards of the proof, though that it, it might be able to uh, go against the single barrel barrel proof rye. But I think that banana is going to dominate. But you don't get the banana either, so I, I can't work with but you. I don't know one. if the nose was is similar to this on that one. No, but I'm, I'm trying to look for one that that because I I actually yeah, secretly be, Steve and I put it up one. against like the Knob Creek that we had. And I didn't even think it was in the same ballpark. Like some people had said, they'd like to see it go up against stuff, but that to me is just such a beast. But overall, for the seventy-four dollars, I, I didn't have an age statement on it, so I, I can't tell you what it is. It is a hun almost one hundred and twenty proof. It's just shy of one hundred and twenty proof. It is that. It you does. Know you're drinking it. You know, for those because I'm getting the mint. For, so for those people that like the rye, uh, that do like rye, I, I would seriously give this a try. It does. Bring you a little bit away from the traditional bourbon-esque flavors that you get after the rye, but it doesn't bring like just the straight 95.5 rye where you're just getting mint and you're not no, getting anything it's, else. It's, it's, obviously, yeah. it's closer to the Bailey Legal rye, which is I, I'm I'm kind of digging it. it, and and it has the kick. So and, I, and you I, really feel the kick. I like whatever the malt is doing on the other end. Like there isn't there is a it sweetness closer to the bourbon. Yeah, you know, normally I th always attribute the corn that's in it in a rye to give you the sweetness but there is a generous you, you do get that sugary <laughs> sweetness with this and it and it does and it has a decent proof but it does it does have a nice finish it's not super long but it doesn't go no. away and you definitely get the you pop actually rock. You almost get with a minimal like a, a tiny little baby or gel numbness mm -hmm. sitting you know so i i, I I'm, I'm liking it is it pricey? Would I get ten of them? Probably not, but it's it's pretty decent. The longer this sits, the better it's getting. That's it would the good be, thing. So I can't wait to thing. see what this opens up into, and see if you get more of that oatmeal see, thickness that you get. From, see, I am, and the longer it keeps sitting in the glass, the more I keep getting that. You still get the sugary sweetness, which I'm I'm in my head. I'm like, oh, I can see like an oatmeal with with a little bit of maple syrup in it. You know what I mean? To give you that, or even when you get the brown sugar and oatmeal and, and, and stuff. Go, you know I what I mean? I almost even go with a brown sugar. Where you and, get right, you know, metal down where, a little where, bit type where, deal. Where you get the sugar sweetness in it, something like that. And with that, and then you get that that hint of the oatmeal. I think this one is going to be one of them bottles that you know, in a couple of weeks, we're going to have to open it back. I think this might turn into something a little bit more special. But I was almost dreading it because the way he kind of made well, it sound. The way you said it I'm sitting just, down here oh danny wanted you to try this one wait to see mike's reaction i was like oh great i really had now. it in my head it was going to be, be in scotch land times three or something i i don't know where i didn't know where you were going so i had I no like, idea i'm only going off of what he said and then again everybody's palate's different so it right? doesn't you know because stuff that he likes we didn't stuff that we like he didn't so so it is yeah. what it is and that's part of drinking whiskey you know and that's the fun part of it so you can leave a comment down below danny like what you got whether you liked it or didn't like it. And yeah, because we don't if, know that part. If, like, our taste profile, was, if like, if all of the, the notes that I'm getting, you know, he's still got the bottle, I believe, so he can try it again and see if he can do it. But, uh, well, there you go. Uh, and everyone else, not that, that we just singled out Danny, he did recommend this one, but anyone else that has had this, leave a comment down below. I'll be curious to see. I'm actually looking forward to having this sit for a minute and then have come back to it because I actually, this, this, is, this is one of my... I'm, this is gonna go if I don't if I don't back myself <laughs> off of it because I actually really like put it up the, there with the others in hiding. It's, I really <laughs> like the way this one tastes, so I hope it opens up. And even so more. it hit pretty hot in the beginning, but now we've had a few sips. It's just like it's now pretty tasty. Yeah, because you you well, actually I, double filled. So and that's what I'm saying. Like, but to, but to, you don't have to help my. Oh, I'm sorry, but no. What what I I'm saying that for the sole purpose of. It goes to show the it, 119, it, did, it drinks no, no. under that it did to hit me. With a, it, in the beginning, it was a good little hit, yep. a good little sparkle, and now yeah, I got the it, baby or gel effect, so I'm in there. It, that's what I mean. It, it doesn't drink like we've had some that our nose does not we, bring that, it anywhere that, near friggin' I, right. That sweet and cold through elbows at 110, we could barely drink it. It, it burnt the whole way down. This is, this is almost 120, and it drinks soft as silk. So, all right. I rambled on long enough. Again, we did. Leave a comment down below on this one. It's going off the fill again. I'm, I'm digging this one. I really am. So there it is. Smoke Wagon Malted Straight Rye Whiskey. Uh, I I definitely would recommend it. Mm -hmm. And if you, you know, leave a comment if you, you don't like it. I, I do like to hear from everyone else anyway. So. And thanks for all the new people that have been chiming in because 
it, it is good to hear. No, I do. Yeah, especially when people give like suggestions or comments yeah. on on like stuff we should try or things that are related to stuff yeah, that we have. Someone so, throw out another squash that no, no, I but see. you know what? This is such a unique mash bill. If yeah. you know of someone else who makes another mash bill like this, leave a comment down below because I'd love to stick it in a blind against each uh, other and see good. what it is. You know what I mean? So, that being said, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Spend less, drink more. Cheers. Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. The more this sits, the better that keeps getting. I, I'm actually...